All right, hello everyone. We are doing some patrolling out here in Bulverde. Paul 13, traffic. Paul 13, go ahead. Paul 13, traffic. Paul 13, show me out at um, G08, be <coughs> westbound. Uh, be out with a four door G. It's gonna be a Texas tag. Ida Frank Union, Union 567, occupied times one. Uh, if you can run me 132. Copy that, Paul 13. What's your nearest postal? We're gonna be uh, close by 067. Mile marker 067, just uh, east of the scale. Copy that. Pull 25, I'll be in route. Alright, guys, so we are out here patrolling in Bulverde, Texas. Got uh, Barrio over there on a traffic stop, so we're gonna go back him up. It's a small town out here in Bulverde, so we have each other's backs, and we're always uh, bagging each other up whenever we get on traffic stops, because they can get real dangerous, so. Five control. I'm out with Paul 13. What's up? How's it going, man? What's going on? Oh, not much. I parked them at like 78 back over here by the diner. So, um, I just wanted to make sure, uh, I, I couldn't clear them off my radar. I'll have to, it's a new radar system that, um, that we have. I, I'm not sure if you know how to clear that block speed, but, um, I just wanted to get another unit down here to make sure everything's coping steady. Yeah, that's, uh, that's pretty quick. Yeah. Okay. Well, let's, I'm going to go check on him. All right. Hope you guys are having a fantastic week so far. It is Wednesday when I'm recording this. Hopefully I'll be able to put this video out same day. Alright, so the reason for the stop today is because um, I blocked you for about 78. Uh, this highway is 65 miles an hour, okay? Uh, is there any reason why you, you're coming at that rate of speed? It is loud on the side of this freeway. No, I understand. You had something bad to you, no worries. Uh, uh, the only issue is when it's Do 
do me a favor, man. I I'm gonna have you just uh, step out of your vehicle for me, okay? Because like I said, you're moving around a whole lot for me. And I'm gonna have you stand out here with my partner. I'm gonna run your information, make sure everything comes back clear. And uh, if it does, man, we'll get you out of here as quickly as we can. But like right now, like I said, man, you're you're just acting a little bit suspicious for me, man. So I'm gonna have you step out here with my partner, okay? Just follow me over here so you don't get hit by a car, man. All right. Just hang back here with my partner. I'm just going to run your information. Like I said, man, if everything comes back clear, uh, we'll get you out of here ASAP, okay? All right, man. How you doing, sir? My name's Officer Wolf, Wolf Verde Police Department. Yep, of course. Badge number is 125. Just waiting on him to run this guy's name. If everything comes back clear, we'll just uh, probably let him go. Maybe Pat frisk him because he's a little nervous. I don't know. I haven't gotten any indicators from him or anything like that, so... And if you guys notice that my game looks different than when I stream, uh, recently over the past like two days, it just seems that Reshade has just stopped working on my on my 5M again. So. Good. All right, man. So. Uh, Here's the thing, because because you were just a little nervous on us, uh, I'm just gonna pat frisk you, okay? Um, just make sure you don't have any weapons on you. I'm not gonna search your pockets, but I'm just gonna uh, just gonna pat frisk you. Make sure you don't have any weapons or any drug paraphernalia on you, anything like that, okay? All right, cool. Nothing on you, so you're good. We'll just uh, chill out here, wait for my partner, get done running your uh, information, okay? Your driver's license is valid, everything's valid with the vehicle. Okay, well if that is the case, then you should just get off with a, uh, a speeding citation, but, you know, 78 is a bit quick. Coming through that pass back there, so you definitely want to slow down, okay? All right, Mr. Frederick. Um, so this is gonna happen, man. Uh, you are gonna get a citation today for speeding, okay? Um, like I said, the speed limit out here is 65 miles an hour. Uh, you're doing at least uh, 13 miles over, okay? So uh, just, it's not a mission to give. I'm just gonna have you sign here for me, okay? And uh, if you have any questions or any issues, feel free to Turn the ticket around, there will be a website there or a phone number that you can call and set up any kind of court hearing, okay? <clears throat> oh, buddy, I appreciate it, man. Let me get you a copy real quick. Uh, Ms. Frederick, uh, you are going to be free to go at this time, okay? Uh, like I said, man, slow down. I get it, man. You had bad food, but still no reason to uh, be driving that fast over the speed limit, man.
okay? I'm trying to keep these highways safe. We get a lot of accidents in this area, okay? So, um, you go ahead and uh, step back in your vehicle if you want for me. jittery for me man um yeah yeah i guess he didn't have you he didn't have anything really to pat. no he, he pat him no. down and there was no gun or nothing right no there was nothing on him so yeah like i said i wasn't sure man but hey uh on these new systems with these radar systems how do you clear that uh that lock the uh, speed up there i don't know i'm gonna have to look back at the uh the manual the, the shop gave me a copy of the manual when they when they installed it in my car they gave me my car back. They they gave me the manual, so I'll have to look back at it and and uh, yeah, yeah. see. Yeah, yeah. You know. out, man. Yeah, hit me up on the radio. I appreciate that because I'm trying to clear out these lock uh, speeds up there. It's been a minute since I've used one of these type of radios. Yeah, absolutely. Well, I'll let you know. All right, man. Well, I appreciate you coming by and helping me out. Um, and uh, be safe out there, brother. You too. See you on the next one. All right. Same traffic. Good. Yeah, I figured out how to unlock those. It's going to be uh, up on the, if you look at the monitor up there, it'll be that right on that num on that 8 and 5 should clear it out. Turn four, thank you. Paul 13, go ahead. 
coming out on a traffic uh, geo waves, we're going to be facing eastbound, be with a two door uh, sports vehicle, red, occupied times one. It'll be a Texas tag, Adam, Tom, Nora, Juliet, 980. No additional at this time. Copy that. Yo! Why is there a dump truck sitting in the middle of the road causing accidents? <coughs> Paul 25 Control, you can shut me out with a disabled vehicle. I'll be uh, westbound US 1 uh, just before mile 7. It'll be a uh, scrap truck, no 28. Alright, let's see what this guy's got going on and what's wrong with his truck. <coughs> this is really dangerous. Hey, y'all right? Lose a tire? Okay. Can you just can you get it off the road with the rest of your tires? Cause this is this is really dangerous. You're causing causing collisions here. So can you just get it off the road for me? Okay. All right. He's gonna try to uh, get it off the road for us, and uh, we're gonna help him out with that. Assist him with uh, making sure nobody rear ends him while he does that. <clears throat> Alright, you good now? Alright, cool. Yeah, I just wanted to make sure you were off the road, man. Um, you can wait here for, uh, just make sure you put your flashers on, put your triangles out, but you can wait here for a, uh, for a truck to come and fix your, change your tire out, okay? Alright, just call us if you need anything, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna jet out of here. You should be good. Nobody should hit you. Cool. All right. Have a good day. Pulse two five control. That uh, disabled vehicle's been cleared from the travel lane. I'll be ten eight. Did not turn my body cam off, did I? I did not. I'm gonna get gas real quick and I'll do that. <laughs> but yeah, I uh, need to figure out what's going on with my reshade again. This is not the first time that 5M has done this. I think when 5M updates, it, it, it breaks reshade. I think that's the gist of what I'm understanding is happening here. Why is this gas station stealing all of my frames? Oh my goodness. That is terrible. <clears throat> yeah, we're getting terrible frames at this gas station right now. 
Sorry about this, guys. Don't really know what's going on. Gotta get the heck out of here. There we go. It was literally just that gas station that was messing us up. Don't really understand that. Alright, so this is a 35. Pretty much all of Toledo's a 35. So we'll get people that are going through this intersection too fast or running these red lights. Anything like that. Looks like I had a plate on his truck. Control Paul 13. Go ahead. Just checking on that status on your traffic, sir. 10-4, I'll put 4. 10-4. What we do, do a little bit of dispassion for each other, you know what I mean? Copy, Paul 13, clear code 4. It is. I don't want to say the Q word. I don't want to say it. But it seems like we'll have a uh, lot of traffic tonight, which I like. I like. You know, I consider the Charger kind of the traffic unit. Um. The other two cars are Explorer, or three cars, Explorer, Taurus, and Durango. I like the Durango, but it's just really slow for a Durango. <gasps> Excuse me. It's pretty slow. Not gonna lie.
go back over the highway here, run some radar. <coughs> Got a semi rolling into town. It's not something you see every day on Polito, on Procopio Drive, I mean. He might be going to the, uh, the, uh, post office down there, or maybe he's going to, I don't know if he, I don't know why if he was going to, uh, the supermarket to deliver if he would, why, why he wouldn't turn left there instead of going straight. <coughs> that was a red light. This guy decided that red lights don't apply to him, so we will definitely correct that behavior. Paul 25 traffic. I'm gonna be westbound Great Eastern Highway, just across from the Cluck and Bell factory, out with a black SUV, Texas marker King Zebra Sam Young 013, occupy times one. Alright, let's run that plate. said let's run that plate. Why am I not getting notifications? What is going on? Uh, hmm. Anyway, let's go ahead and just approach and see why this person thinks that red lights don't apply to them. <coughs> <clears throat> Sorry, guys. Hello? Hold on your window, please. Thank you. Hello? Officer Wolf with the Bolverde Police Department. Good evening. Can I have your driver's license, registration, and proof of insurance, please? Where are you headed? Alright, where are you coming from? Okay. You know why I pulled you over? No. Uh, you ran a red light. There's no hassling going on. At all. Well, you did. I mean, you, you, you came to a stop, and then you proceeded through the red light. I would have been fine if you would just... I mean, you were going a little... Probably going a little fast. I didn't catch your speed. Um... But you you were able to come to a complete stop, and then you decided to continue through the red light. So that's the issue, right? But uh, yeah, sit tight, Mister uh, Gutierrez. Gutierrez. Okay, I'll be back with you in a few minutes. Okay, this is a uh, this this copy of your license is expired. Do you have a do you have a valid copy, sir? Okay, well, I get told that all the time, but uh, that's definitely an issue, okay, if your license has been expired for almost three years now, okay? So, um, just sit tight and I'll be back with you in a few, okay? Alright. We got traffic, traffic stops right across from each other, that's great. <coughs> Alright, let's, uh... 
run this gentleman to see what's going on with him. That is a last name that I could not pronounce. G-U-T-I-E-R-R-E-Z. Yeah, this is the issue that he's going to run into here. Um, um, Alright, valid valid on the vehicle. He's just going to receive a citation on his license being expired, and I am going to end up towing his vehicle. Because it's definitely not good. I mean, your license has been expired for going on three years. Literally a month from being three years. That's insane. That's crazy. So, we're definitely going to get him... Um, I'm towing his car. He can't, he can't drive away. I mean, at this point, his license should... It could have been suspended. Um... Alright. So we'll go ahead and print his citations out. And we will... get him out of the car first. Alright, sir. So, uh, because your license has been expired for over, almost three years, okay, um, since, tw since 2021, alright, um, it seems like what you did was, you m might, you might have a CDL because your license was valid for ten years, and then you never renewed it. You just let it expire, so that's not good. Oh, you thought that if your CDL expired that your regular license just took back over? Well, the, the problem is you haven't renewed your regular license either because this is your regular license now. So that doesn't even really make sense. And they tell you that at the DMV when they give you your license, when you give it, when they give you your uh, CDL. You, you, your, the old copy is null and void now. This is your license now. So... Um, but anyway, uh, I am going to impound your vehicle, okay, just because your license has been expired for so long. Um, can't let you drive if you're not valid, okay? <clears throat> no, you won't get to the DMV when you can't. Well, you will get to the DMV when you can, but, uh, I'll be impounding the vehicle, okay? Alright, go ahead and step out of the car for me. Perfect, thank you. Um, I also have these citations here for you for uh for driving while your while your license is invalid so come on back to my car let's have you sign these <coughs> i am going to be keeping your license just because it is uh expired and you can't drive on an expired license so you'll have to go to the dmv whenever you can and get that uh sorted um but other than that just go ahead and uh, sign the citation here for me, and I'm going to be calling a, um, a tow truck for your vehicle. All right, that's fine. Also, if you if you renew your license now and by your court date, which is the 10th of February, which is when your license, which is when your license becomes three years expired, if you renew it before then and just show up to court with the renewed document then they'll dismiss the ticket, and you won't even have to pay. All we want you to do is renew your license. That's it. We don't want money out of you. We just want you to renew your license. And it's not that uh, it's not that expensive. You know what I mean? So just go ahead and get that done. But uh, your vehicle is going to be impounded. Um, I'm not even going to inventory it or anything like that, because, well, I'll probably, yeah, I'll probably inventory it. Um, <coughs> but, uh, yeah, just sit tight for me right here. And I'll be back with you in a few seconds. Alright, so we're just going to uh, have a look-see here. Looks like he doesn't really have anything of value inside. We'll just document all that. Alright, all that's good.
Paul 25, requesting a 1051, my location, for a black SUV rear wheel drive. Alright. Uh, I gotta be ready to. Nope, 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 nope. There we go. Gotta be ready to stop him when he goes to do that. There's my tow truck. Is it gonna get here? Is it gonna make its way here? No. No. No, it got cancelled. Okay. We'll, we'll call it through, uh... We'll see if we can call it through PD5M then. Oops. Did not mean to tow him. <laughs> That's hilarious. Alright man, so uh, tow truck's on the way, um, but you're free to go, okay? Uh, please don't get back inside your vehicle. Nope. 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 Whoa, whoa! Just gonna... Uh, this. Fuck, I'm on the track, I'm gonna cut the possession. <coughs> Hello, Mrs. Carlson. All right, so he's calling a ride, and uh, will be code four. Maybe we'll go over here and check on our partner and see what he's got going on. Paul two 